Hello YouTube, this is Danny and Carl again today and today we have a first for a YouTube we have a Mothinizer attachment for the 700 but it will fit most of the Coke coffee can style vacuums that Hoover made this particular item here is made of like tin and this converts the Hoover vacuum cleaner into a moth killing machine it says the household enemy number one the moth back in the old days well that will kill a moth now yeah that's a 21st century moth killer but this is a 1920s moth killer before they actually had aerosol sprays all, all that all this the well, moths used to go in and, and make holes in clothes and then lots of fabric, you know, like the settees and things like that. So, as you can see there, you put the muffinizer on the back, back. And then you put the crystals in it. I haven't got any crystals. We haven't got the crystals. I've just put the white in there. And then you can stick it. I'm the new settee or in the wardrobe. You stick it in the wardrobe? No. With, I with, you have to shut the door. No. With... With and you can put it under the settee. No, that, that's how you do it in the wardrobe. That's how you do it in the wardrobe. Well, Carl's now going to demonstrate how to do it. So first job is we take the bag off. There, we've done that quickly. Right, we've got rice to go in there today. Uh, this is what we'll do with the moth and ice. Yeah, you have to buy. They years ago they sold moth moth crystals, which obviously was like a smell that they didn't like, or a poisonous gas. Because basically we're going to use the vacuum as a blower to blow the smell. So we've got rice in there today, because obviously I can't go to the local supermarket and ask for moth killing crystals. So they'll probably chuck me out the shop. I don't think B and Q or Home Base have probably got it either. So yeah, well that's it. Well, there's there's the moth. I think Home Base or or uh, the or Can I show you that? or Tesco sell the moth sir. New to do, and now the right and now you're going to attach that to the machine. With the bag on, exactly the same. We don't put the bag on. No, I wouldn't put the bag on. It's sat in the same. Right. Same. Now we have to take the belt off. Is that right? Yeah. We have to turn the machine over. Uh, it's not on. All right, we'll do that in a minute. Just take, take, take the belt off. There's a little lever there. It comes off. And this one, you need to take. Oh, take it off. And this one, you need to keep this off. Right, you have to leave that off. Yeah. So we'll put that over there on top of the tools. And now pull it back. Obviously, oh. it's got to suck the air in from somewhere. Now it's going to sound like when the chapman's on now. Right now, Carl's now going to put the muffinizer onto the back of it. The moth coating aerosol type sort of thing. Some turbo. This is a bit like an, an, an iPhone of yesteryear, basically. It just does everything. Like a brand new iPhone. You can just... A bit like an iPhone, like a smartphone. You know, it's got a moth killing function as well on it, as well as vacuuming your carpets and uh, scrubbing your floors. Now you put the uh, attachment on. You've got to screw it in now. Like, like when you pull it on the back of there. The, yeah, you like can actually you... put it on the back of there as well, and you can use it as a blower function as well for blowing the cobweb. See, it's got a moth on it. It's got a moth in it. Don't see so many moths now, do you? No, only on cheese. Then you plug that in. And now I'll just pop it on the roll set. Cheese. Yeah. So we're just gonna just show you now because we were we're basically gonna be showing you. Now we plug it in Anywhere to the transformer. 
a C a a two a a one. Like I say, keep keep their clothes to last well because moths used to just eat. See, it's coming out there. Right, it will do. That's just showing the crystals, isn't it? So there he is. There is the Hoover. No, that's a stone. Moth and Isaac. I think they probably would put it on if we can find the manual. Let's see if I can see how long it takes to um. This. There he is. And nice and white. And now look at it. It says ah. it's generally during the spring and the fall, frequent treatment destroys the moth life and should be given at least three times with additional treatments during the winter for air conditioned houses. If properly conducted, the furniture or the fungalizing treatment described here kills all stages of moth life and will prevent reinfestation. About that eye. But it doesn't say what? how long you're supposed to put it on for. I should imagine you put it on for say an hour or so or half an hour. But well there Whee! is. There is we've only put rice in it because we're not gonna put in. Whee! And it says on on there that Whee! disconnect belt and leave pulley core off while using this, this device. So there he is. This is a Hoover Moth And what are you going to say now, Kyle? Yes. Wee! Basil! Wee! Now. And please subscribe if you want to see some more interesting or oh, different sorts of videos about vacuums. We've still got. They, they, plenty. Come, they come to the same. They come to the right place. You come to the right place. We have got loads more vacuums. About 20 more. That we can show at least so just keep keep tuned you never know what you're going to be getting look at this say bye kyle